Look at this horse has like dirt coming out of his nose. Yeah. They don't usually get dirty. Don't they Thanksgiving and other one named Christmas? Everybody, I'm Garrett. And I'm Carolyn. And we're Diary of a Family. We're living life intentionally with you. We are out at a farm somewhere between Olympia and Aberdeen, Washington. Yeah. Our friends Bridget and Richard have invited us to come out to a farm. I don't know if it's a friend's farm. Yes. So she uh, taught school um, with the lady that owns this farm up in Alaska and okay. they have retired here and began farming in Washington. Cool. They have all kinds of fun animals. Oh my goodness. We, uh, Bridget got attacked by a turkey. <laughs> so I'll show you guys that. <laughs> <laughs> Did you get that on film? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't think they like that one. I was getting a selfie. <laughs> We're gonna just walk around and be shown this little farmhouse. It's really cute, very quintessential farmhouse. I love the vintage uh, Land Rover. I mean, it's probably not running at all, but. So this is a farm rehabilitation project. We're in the middle of renovating this barn. He's walking in the pathway, which I think is probably for drainage for the cows poop and pee. <laughs> That's a poo trough. But we have um Are they the guard turkeys? They seem to be following us around everywhere. This is really cool. They have some mini horses. Little Sebastian. Wow, the mane is like is like wiry. Might be little Sebastian. Yeah. Oh look, <laughs> look over there. I know. Edison, he's your size. You could climb. It's an Eddie size horsey. Hi. Maybe yes. I want the to try. Mommy, maybe I want to try to ride the pony. Okay, we'll go look at it. <laughs> yeah, I saw that. It's just not. It stands for not our cat because it just showed up here. It lives in the barn. So. So he's not your cat, but he just hangs out here. Yeah, we feed it. Oh look, they got ducks. Yeah, I know. Oh, I don't know. People bring him in. And, yeah. Oh, Wow. We're told over and over again, these guys are friendly. Thanksgiving and Christmas are friendly. We got a little donkey and a little horse. When people find you have a farm, they call you up and say, you want a horse? And then we're like, okay, so someone dropped it off. The horse is just the size for me. Yeah, see, he like, he like has a blood stash, the guy's right there. And then this is his buddy. He's about three, and this is the buddy, Dudley, and Dudley is about 14. Spend most of their day chasing each other and wrestling, and they actually get each other on the ground and sit on each other. Yeah, it's crazy. We move them around. We don't always have them in this pasture. But one will start biting the other one, trying to get it to chase. He has huge Lord. ears. Okay, the horse will be freaking out of the water, and this guy will come up and slam him in the back and dunk his head, and then stand there and get kicked. And then they chase that around and he goes right back to drinking again. And this guy slams his head into water and gets kicked. And this goes on for like an hour or so. The kids started throwing apples over to the cows. Next thing you know, every single cow in the pasture is running here, waiting to uh, eat all the apples that the kids are throwing. And kids are like sitting there hitting cows and stuff with their apples and we're like, hey, just don't hit the cows. You can throw the ca apples to the cows. Don't hit the cows. But they're having fun throwing anyways. Well, the apples... We're sitting there watching like the apples just raining and the cows are like getting pelted with apples. And you're like... Yeah. Look, they're such fuzzy cows. <laughs> they 
are so cute. Don't hit the cows. Don't hit the cows. <laughs> you silly McDillie bones. Why'd you hit the cows? He doesn't want to come close. Look at his tongue. <laughs> Look, the little, the little calves are just sitting back there. Like, I'm shocked. Yeah, well, those babies aren't interested in apples. Oh, you want the boys, the boys, or the girls? Right. Go ahead. Uh, don't jump all over you. They're friendly. These are the little boys, we've been told. Hello, little boy. Hello. Can we the big one? He has horns. Hello, little boys. I like, I like, I like. What? That's what they want. They want to climb on you. They want to climb on me? <laughs> oh my goodness. He's climbing. <laughs> Cleaning it with a feather. Do you notice this one is darker and it's all speckled? My mom had some Brahma. The one, the, this one is probably, I have a Brahma icy cross. Hmm. Two actually. They might follow you, but they won't hurt you. Look at that. Look at that. They're back there. Oh, they see you. <laughs> Yeah, be fine. Come on. Right in here. Here, jump it all in. No, wait, wait. No. Nope, right, right in, in the bowl. Okay. And then they'll come in here and eat it. Right. You see that there, Thank you all for joining us. We had a lot of fun today. I think the kids have learned a lot about the animals and farm life. Thank you to Bridget and Richard for bringing us along and their friends for opening up this beautiful farm to us. The kids have a questionnaire now from the owners and we'll definitely be enjoying that on the way back. It's like this cute little like all kinds of questions about the animals. <laughs> Bridget's joining us. All right, thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, give it a life thumbs up. Intentionally. <laughs> and as always, live, live life, life intentionally. intentionally. Bye. Bye.